name is Mary and welcome to my channel, Mary Making Crafts. I have another Diamond Art Club sneak peek video for you. Um, very excited about this one uh, for Black Friday 2023. This is one of over, not over, but <laughs> one of a hundred kits that D Diamond Art Club is going to be releasing for Black Friday. And I'm excited to have the opportunity to share this one with you. So thanks to Diamond Art Club for sending this to me. But this is Lean on Me by Jody Bergsma. Um, we have these two beautiful kitty cats here with kind of a, this reminds me of like a yin and yang symbol here. It's gorgeous. Um, so we've got, this one is 22 inches by 33 inches or 55.8 by 83.8 centimeters. So there you have it. That's the artwork. We've got round diamonds. I did go ahead and take the plastic off of this just for this video's sake, but I have not opened our box yet. <laughs> um, I am trying, I have been mentioning this in a few of my unboxings recently that for Black Friday, I know you guys have a bunch of videos you guys want to watch. So I am trying to speed things up just ever so slightly without compromising any quality and making sure that I'm still showing you everything that I always show you. So We've got our dust cover bag there. We also have our small sticker. You can use this for whatever you like. And uh, we also have our toolkit. So let's take a look at the contents of that really quickly. Okay, so taking a look at the contents of our toolkit. First up, we've got our Diamond Art Club tray and stopper to line up your drills. We have wax. There are two pads of wax in here. We have a pen and a squishy. Now mine are pink, but your pen and squishy color, um, while they will coordinate, may differ from mine. So we've got that there. And then to go on the other end of your pen, we have a four placer or a seven placer. So you can place multiple diamonds at one time. We also have a bag of baggies for kitting up or down your diamond painting, whatever you would like to use those for. We also have some washi tape here. You can use this to cover the glue on the edges of your painting or to section off your painting, however you like. And we've got this pretty floral pattern there. And last but certainly not least, we also have a cover minder. So cover minders have two little magnets on the back. You just take one of those magnets off, slide it underneath your canvas, pull your plastic cover back and have the magnets meet and it will hold your cover for you. This one's a cute little rose and I love it so much. It's very sweet. So there you have it. There are the contents of our toolkit. I'm gonna go ahead and clean this up and we'll take a look at what's inside that dust cover bag. Alrighty, so getting straight to business here. We've got a couple of inserts in here that we're gonna take a look at first and then we will take a look at all of the drills. So first up, we've got our thank you. Um, this is just a little insert saying thank you for your purchase. Instructions to go to the VIP Facebook group. Um, also some QR codes to head over to the app if you've never purchased on the app before. You get 20% off your very first purchase in the app. So definitely recommend that. Set that aside here. We also have our sticker sheet. So you've got your logbook sticker and a larger image of the artwork there with start and end date. Again, you can use this for whatever you like. Look at this, I love the colors, how pretty. Um, so we've got, let's see, 63 colors in this one. So pull that out so you can see all 63 there. And we have just one under the number 150. Um, so that's gonna be your only AB, is gonna be a white AB. AB just stands for Aurora Borealis for that iridescent coating on there. And then we have three Zs. So the Zs are fairy dust drills. So you can see these symbols down here. Um, they are going to have some glitter on the outside of them. So those will be really pretty to take a look at. I'm curious to see where they go and we will definitely take a look at that on the canvas. But all of these stickers are individual here so you can use that to kit your painting up um, and use those stickers on your 
on your drill containers. So we also have our bag of drills here. Here's your, your color your color palette and then um we also have it individually labeled if you choose to store your drills and your paintings separately so or your canvases separately we've got the ab just hanging out right there anyway so i'm going to go ahead and pull these drills out we can take a look at them one by one and then we'll take a look at the canvas just after that First up for our drills, we have that 141, that is our AB with the iridescent coating, 803, 356, 415, 336, 6020. That's a new number to me, haven't heard of that one. Next, we've got 160, 3802, 158, 951, 414, 3042, 823. 317, 939, two bags of that, 3860, 310, Z778. Here is our first of the fairy dust. You can see that glitter on there. And 3830. 355, 3834, Z722. There's our second fairy dust. 452, 413, 6021. 312 and 3801-799, 3721-3837-754-792, 3865-3727-3861, 550-948-152, 3838-358-359, 322, 519, 809, 554, 357, 918, 921, 352, and 340. 807, 815, Z341. There's our final uh, fairy dust drill there. 333, 37.99, 209.00. 826, 224, and 156. And finally, our last strand here, 920, 318, 6014, 161, and 3778. So there you have it, all 63 colors that are in this palette. Um, lots of blues and purples, oranges and beiges, really exactly kind of what that image looked like. I feel like it's very true to what the the outside image on that uh, on that sticker sheet looked like. Just to give you a a reminder. So it looks really great. I'm excited. I'm gonna pull the special drills out of here. We'll take a look at the canvas, and then I'll show you where those specials go. All right, you guys, I've got a pretty good view of this where I'm really not cutting off very much of it, which is very exciting to me, um, but I'm very excited. Who's ready? Um, really quickly, I always show you guys, we have these beautiful serge and scalloped edges um, and this nice velvet backing. These canvases are the best quality. These will not fray. It's just lovely. Um, on the bottom left here too, I always like to show that we have um, fully licensed artwork, um, just showing that Diamond Art Club is fairly compensating artists um, for their the use of their artwork. Also, please look at this beautiful glue on this canvas. It is just flawless. It's awesome. And their symbols are beautiful. Never had an issue. Anyway, <laughs> here it is. This is stunning. I'm in love. All right, so. As you can see, we are not cutting off very much from the bottom or the top. That's your top right there. Um, so you're really getting the whole view here and I wanted to make sure that you got that because here's your bottom. So you're seeing everything of importance on this canvas and I wanted to make sure of that. Um, I did go ahead, I did take a little sneak peek. I can't lie because I wanted to show you where these specials go um, right away. So we weren't wasting any time, okay? So these uh, ABs, which is your, it's kind of a dot symbol on the canvas. 
Um, these are really anywhere that you see white on the canvas. So the insides of these cats on this little symbol down here below. Um, also any of the fur on the cats that is white, um, including the whiskers like above the eyes and the regular whiskers. Both of them are, um, they're all going to be this white AB. So I'm going to put this right here. Whoops. You know, I tried. Um, <laughs> I tried to get it right there. But um, here, I have to fix it. It's going to bug me. Okay. Anyway, um, so I'll try to scoot this back up now. Anyway, so it also is in that star up at the very top um, and the little star over here. So it's everywhere that you see white on the canvas. Then we have our fairy dust. And these are a little bit more, I don't want to say strategically placed, but they are. They were a little harder to find. Um, so you have this light blue here. And I found this um, the most in this cat down here in the little symbol down below. But then also anywhere you see like super light blue on the like purple toned cat because we've got like kind of a purple tone and an orange toned cat um in my eyes or blue and and orange kind of blue and purple anyway so this is kind of like i see a lot of it here in these stripes um but it's also up in the head like it's everywhere it's a lot on that cat and then um similarly for the orange this is our symbol U. Now I didn't find this. It is in that the orange cat's face, um, but it is mostly down here on the outside edges of this symbol as well as the, as with that blue that's in this symbol. So it was just a little tough to find. Like some of these fairy dust, I feel like are more, like I said, strategically placed. Now this one is interesting. So this one is our final one, this pink color. And this pink color is actually in both of the cats, which I thought was really cool. So um, it's kind of the, I guess the color that links the two of them together. Um, I found it in, you know, um, a lot in like the cat's face and down here in that like this pink stripe here. But then it is also on the orange kitty, in the orange kitty's face, and down here on the paw. So I thought that was really cool that it kind of connected both of the cats together. But this painting is stunning, and I really love it. Um, it's one of those, like, it didn't quite catch my eye at first, and then, like, the longer I looked at the original image, and then now, like, the more that I look at the rendering, I'm in love with this piece. I wanna take these um, specials off of here just so you can really like, there's literally my foot in the in the painting there, sorry, <laughs> in the frame. Um, but let me get these out of the way for you. Um, I just want you to be able to see how sweet the faces are on here. And I just, I guess I just love what this painting represents. I love the title of it, Lean On Me. So I'll just kind of zoom in a little there so you can see their little, their sweet faces. I don't know, I'm just in love, you guys. I think this is so sweet. I think it's a really beautiful, like, representation of kitty love. I don't know. I, it's it's very different from my usual style and I think that's why I'm like I'm I'm just digging it so much. <laughs> I'm so into it. Um this is gorgeous. So, I'm excited that I was given a chance to kind of break out of my my normal kitty cat zone into something a little bit more abstract and meaningful, I guess is how I'll put it. Um not that every painting can't have meaning, but I just I really like the meaning behind this one. So yeah, there you have it. 
it's just so beautiful. I love it so much. Anyway, let me know if this one is going to be on your uh, must haves or your wish list for Diamond Art Club's Black Friday. Um, leave me some kind of star. I don't know, this this gives me some like celestial vibes and I kind of love it. Um, so leave me like a star emoji if you made it this far. Um, I love to throw that in my videos and see who's truly watching to the end. Um, but thank you so much for joining me. I do still have a few more sneak peeks coming at you um, for this Black Friday release. This painting will be released on Friday, November 24th. Um, at 7 a.m. Pacific, 10 a.m. Eastern um, for general release. If you are a Diamond member um, with the rewards program at Diamond Art Club, then you will have an early access window at midnight Pacific um, or 3 a.m. Eastern uh, for the Black Friday release the night prior. So keep your eyes peeled for this release. It is one of 100 kits that are coming out and it is definitely in my my top 10 right now. I love this. Um, so yeah, let me know if you'll be picking this one up. I can't wait to hear from you guys. Thank you so much for sticking around. Make sure you subscribe to see what else I've got on the way. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.